And we are back with another Red Dead Online video. It's been a little while. Um, in fact, one of the main reasons why I haven't posted any Red Dead or any YouTube videos for a while is because I was on vacation for a week. I just got, we literally just got home about a few hours ago. We went to Florida. So, um, I haven't been home to to get to play the game or anything, make any videos, so unfortunately, yeah, if anyone was wanting to see some videos from me, sorry. <laughs> but, it's okay, because, um, the new DLC just came out today. Uh, actually, before we get the new gun, we're gonna go to the post office real quick. We're gonna buy the new gun to customize it, but first, we're gonna go to the post office, because we got a letter from Madame Lazar or someone that said I got a letter. Um, but I just downloaded the game. In fact, I also just had to download GTA Online as well, but I'm not gonna do videos on that, because I don't really like to do heists online, because you have to deal with the idiotic players, you know, like... <laughs> So I'm probably not going to do the heist unless I somehow find a friend that wants to play with me. Um, I'm just looking at the daily challenges. I have not played this game in, like I said, a week. Um, oh. Yeah, what did I get? What kind of delivery do I have? Ancient tools. What's this? Oh, is this from Madame Nazar, I'm guessing? And I got all this stuff from the rewards. Dynamite, I'll take that. Treasure maps. That's the thing, I hardly ever use treasure maps. <laughs> um, let's check out the letter it said that I got. From business opportunities letter? What's this? Is this new? Oh, from Crips. Okay, yeah, this is for the new DLC, so I'm just gonna read this real quick. Exciting news, I just found out that. <laughs> Back from the dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. Alright, yeah. Sorry about that. So we just read that. Oh, the shopping list. Is that from, um... Player... Oh, is that I got some kind of shopping list? Um... The outlaw pass. I don't know. Okay, I don't, um... Hold on. What was it? What was it? Was it under... I can't find it anymore. Oh. No, I don't think it was. Alright, never mind. Let's just um forget about that. I don't know what that was telling me. So basically, what we're going to do is we're going to go... First, we're going to go buy ourselves a new gun. Because, of course, a new gun. And then we're going to go here to Emerald Ranch. And we are going to start that mission and get ourselves a moonshining, uh, moonshining shack. Yeah, I'm sorry if I talk a little weird or different. Because literally I've just been on the road for, um, <laughs> hours. Like the whole night I got a little sleep, but it was really hard. So, yeah, I might not talk perfectly. But I'm, I really wanted to play the game. I wanted to make a video of it. So again, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm sorry Careful if I talk weird or if I mispronounce something. I'm still tired. I'm still worn out. Actually, you know what we're going to do? Because um, we're going to get the well, gun after the clothes. I'm sorry about all the stuff that are on. And I'm not thinking the best right now just because the trip. But uh, what we're going to do next, and this is something I was really excited for, and I forgot all about it until I, right as I was about to buy that gun, is a freaking bandolier. Back we got to buy ourselves days. a bandolier. Or two. We'll Everything see what they look that like. That was one thing I really wanted in this game was um, bandoliers that we could actually put on any, like, 
any of our outfits, so where would they be? Spurs. I thought they'd be under accessories. Um. Wouldn't they be? That's what I thought they'd be. Chaps, gloves. Reminder, we is a cash only business. Neckwear. No, no, I don't know. Where, what the heck? Where are the bandoliers? I know they said that they added them. What? They gotta be here somewhere. Um. Here may oh it might be under here moonshiner. Let's see oh no these are just outfits I don't want outfits I want freaking bandoliers man. Now I feel like I've been screwed. They said they added them. Yeah these are just outfits I don't want outfits. So it's got to be in our clothing somewhere. Would it be under ammunition? I wouldn't think so. Because it's not ammo. I have no idea, no. We'll just keep flipping through this. Where on earth are they under vest, maybe? I have no idea. I want me a gosh darn bandolier. No, they weren't under there. <laughs> I feel like I got ripped off. What on earth? There's gotta be some way to get a bandolier. What? Where are they? Unless are they drip feet or something? I wouldn't think they'd be under shirts. Oh! You know what I just realized? Oh my god, I'm such a moron. I think they might be at the gun store. I'm thinking that they're just a general piece of clothing. Oh my god, I'm such a moron. And plus that's where you buy the bandolier in um, story mode too. Oh my god. I can't believe how stupid I am. Oh my goodness. That trip really messed me up. Because I was just thinking because a bandolier uh -huh. is a Go piece ahead. of clothing, not a gun. But because you get the bandoliers in... Yep, there they are. You get the bandoliers in um, story mode. Okay, so wow. Well, let's, let's take a look. Hold on, I'm going to grab a drink. Okay, um... Fortunately, since it's not daytime, I can't accurately look at the bandolier to decide which one I want, because it's freaking dark out. Wow, these look pretty cool. I'm so happy that we finally got a bandolier. Or bandoliers. I don't know which one I'm going to get because I want to see it better in the light. It's hard to tell from here, but I am definitely going to be getting one for sure. Kind of like the red, almost. If that's a red, looks like it. That goes well with my outfit. Man, that looks so cool. <laughs> Bandoliers are just so awesome. Every time I replay the story mode, because every time I play the story mode, I always buy the bandolier for Arthur. Every time. No questions asked. So there's some pretty cool bandoliers over here. I don't know. I'm thinking I'd probably just start off with a one bandolier first. I think two might make it a little more clunky. I think one would be good enough for now. So there's three, one, one of these. Kind of like... No, I'm gonna do it on. I'm gonna read the info on it. Pouch. Huh. 
<laughs> yeah. I'm just kind of reading the description. I wish it would turn light already. You're fine, I'll keep it at least. <laughs> I do think that it's cool that they have two band that they have dual bandoliers. Oh, this this one's limited stock. So that's going to be and it's 18 gold. I see. Two bandlers are twice as stylish. What time is it, man? I, I should have yeah, started mind. the stream in day. Shot. It's stupid night time. 3 a.m. Sorry, I'm. I just can't buy bandlier until it's day, so I can truly. What the heck? Oh, that's a player. I'm sorry. Yeah, I can't. I can't buy anything until I can, um, get out of the way. Until it's day so I can make a, a good decision on what I like. Oh, there's a collectible in here. Good. Good, good, good. <sighs> What do y'all think of my outfit? Huh. I'm actually... This outfit was trying to... I tried to make it similar to an artillery outfit from the Civil War. Here, I'll go in the light. Because, um... You got the red kept by, which is artillery. You got a red, um... That, or shirt. Not vest. Yeah, like I said, I'm not thinking the best right now. And the pants... I'm trying to make gray to make it look confederate. So, yeah. I'm a southern country boy, basically. Oh, hey. I know, some people might say, oh, you're confederate, this or that, or you might think I'm racist or something, but that ain't true. I just like showing support for the south. So yeah, I try to make it look kind of confederate artillery. Well, it's definitely artillery, but there isn't like an, a confederate artillery coat you can wear. Otherwise, that would be perfect. Like if you could wear the um the coat or the uniform that that confederate officer has in story mode, that would be perfect. I would wear that in a heartbeat. Uh, welcome back. So yeah. Um. Is there any daily challenges in the saloon I have to do? Hold on. Jumped onto a horse. Shotgun and showdowns. Ooh, plump bird meat. I think I have some of them. Don't I? Hold on. Um, let me look. I know I had some. I have 10. Oh, nice. Perfect. That'll work. Let's do that real quick so we can um, get a daily challenge done and get some gold and XP. And I'm ranked 132, I think. Okay. Yeah, I haven't. I, <laughs> I didn't prepare for this update very much because, you know, I went on this trip, but uh, <laughs> yeah. I really wish these DLCs hadn't come out when I was on this trip. Alright, so... We're gonna... turn it into... I think I have to make it with the season, right? I think. Yeah, I'm sorry it's taken so long, but it's dark and I want to make a good decision when I'm buying my stuff. Alright, yeah, okay, good. So, we'll just make two more of them. Just had to make sure. Looks like it's going to be turning day soon. Yeah, it's already getting bright. Plain plump. There we go. We'll get ourselves another one.
Eh, we'll stow it, I guess. I don't really use this stuff. Wait, I don't have any more? I thought it said I had ten plump. What? Hold on a second. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. Yeah, right. Oh. Plain plump bird. What? It says I have ten of them. Oh. Oh, okay, that's cooked. Never mind, I'm a moron. Ignore me. I'm just way too out of it right now. Are there any... Anything else? Hold on. Man, I just need one more turkey. Oh, I have an idea then. Hold on. Northern pike caught. Oh, yeah. Alright, hold on. Here's something we can do real quick. Hopefully. Then we'll buy our stuff once once we do this. Hey, get Shut up. Alright. I'm gonna do this. So that I can do not do that. Awesome. Cool. Oh, come on! What? That is stupid. I'm trying to jump on my horse. I've done this before like a million times. <laughs> Oh, come on! That is so dumb. Alright, maybe we don't have to hitch him. I'm just trying to do a stupid daily challenge. Oh no, the horse is moving. did this all the time. I don't know why it's not letting me do it now. Oh my god. This better do it. Yes, thank you. But it didn't give me the challenge? Oh, awesome. Even though I jumped from the horse. Alright, you know what, screw it. We're just gonna go and buy our stuff now. Stupid, dumb game. Oh, there you are. Yeah, alright, we're gonna buy our band first. <sighs> I think we might go with this one. Don't know for sure yet. Let's look at all bandoliers. I don't think I'm gonna go with the double one though. I kinda just wanna go with the single one for now. And I think, ooh, you know what? I kinda like this one as well. I like the silver looking bullets, that's pretty cool. I don't think I like this one as much. I think it'd be more between this one and that one. What kind of colors can I get with this? Let's take a look. Ooh, yeah, I like that red. That looks sick. Yeah, I think this is gonna be the one right here. That one, yes. I love it. Oh, uh, let me look at it real quick. That was the Higgins. Right. 
Yeah, I like the pouches on that too. I think we're gonna go with this one, yeah. And how much is that? Ten gold or two hundred bucks. Alright, we'll buy it. Screw it. This is a freaking bandolier. Darn it. Oh, I got gold. Oh, probably because I bought this. Because it's a clothing style. Nice, I got gold for buying something. And well, XP. Alright, this will be here when you need it. Oh, this is what I was looking for. Yeah, this was the, um... Ancient tools. Yeah, this is the thing it said it was looking for. Oh, I have both of them? I guess I have them both. Okay. I guess I'll probably turn them in. I haven't even seen what I have in my collections. Some of them may belong to a gang. How would I know? Okay, so we got that done. This guy. Actually, I think we're gonna change our outfit when we're done with this. Alright. So now let's buy our new gun. Oh, wait, we got a trade award? For what? What did we do? Oh. Okay. Alright, I'll take it. Unique weapons? What was this? Oh, the rare shotgun. Okay. So we got revolvers. Let's read this. I haven't read this yet. Behold this 36 caliber. between the states. Yep, a civil war. Alright, we're not gonna read this all. We're gonna buy it. Hopefully it's a good gun. Wait, can I use 11 gold to buy it? Wow. I guess we use money. And I got an award. Cool. So, components. Let's customize this baby. Mm, basic or ironwood. Pearl. Hmm. We're definitely going to upgrade. Do the basics. Here. Obviously. Rifling. 60 bucks. Jeez. But it's worth it to get this baby up. Iron sights. I don't see much difference. <laughs> but if it helps with my accuracy, why not? <laughs> Styles. Should I make it all gold? I wonder how it would look gold. It's gonna cost me a fortune though. Oh my god. Yeah. Not doing that. That's copper, silver, brass. It's kind of like gold. Hmm. This kind of looks like my Lamette revolver, so I think I want to go with a different look to it. Wait, it says this costs zero gold? No way. I could just get free color like that? Wow. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> Actually, you know what? Hold on. How about we... Let's see. How much of this is works for gold? So 
So all of this is 30 each. I might want to gold up a little bit. Maybe not all of it. Dang, that's expensive as heck. Freaking. Alright, I think I have an idea. Shouldn't have bought that copper. So now I had to waste another gold. I think I want... How would that look? Pretty cool. That gold. Oh, I mean, we're not going to gold up the whole thing, but I think I want to gold up some of it. Not that. Not that or that. We'll go that up and I think we'll gold this up too. There. Yeah, we don't really need that stuff. Not really. I kind of like that. Um, actually, hold on a second. Let's go back to see what kind of grip we want. We don't want that. I don't really care for ebony. Don't really want that. I think it's either between this or that. Let's um, go back to varnish. Kind of like that, honestly. That looks kind of cool. It almost looks like a zebra. That kind of looks cool too with the gold. Hmm, there's some really cool colors in here. I think I like this one the most. Wait, all of this is. Oh, okay. Hmm. Alright, I think we're just gonna go with this then. And I think that will be our gun. We already have ammo for the revolver. So now we got... Oh, we got an award again. Sharpshooter award. Yeah, never mind. Worth a shot. Okay. Cool, cool. So now we have a bandolier and a new gun. Wow. You look like a damn fool Hold on a second. Thing out. I don't want to do. Shut up, dude. How many bullets does, um, oh, let's see, all right, hold on. I want to look at my navy revolver, or my Lamat, just to see how that looks compared to my navy. Yeah, it's going to look sick. I like it. Yeah, I like that. Um, let's go to our outfits. I think, cause I think I'd like to see what this bandolier would look like with I another outfit I have. Um, <gasps> come on, outfits. No. Oh wait, what was that? Well, that's like a. I don't know if I've seen that one before. That's like a U.S. Army outfit. Alright, where's my outfits at? Alright. Right, yeah, here it is. I want this. 
with my bandolier. Oh wait, no. Darn it. Forget to buy something. This will look perfect. Hold on. If I can get it to work. Backpack equipment? Bandliers, okay. Yes! Now, this will make my uh, Ray outfit much better. Because he always wore bandliers. Perfect. I like it. Something We're good. Mind. We're out. We got a bandolier on now. We got Ray McCall on. We gotta fix our camera. And we are off to our destination. Sorry it took so long in Valentine. Oh, we definitely gotta try this gun out while we're out. Bo show. I wonder what it sounds like and how strong it's gonna be. But yeah, we're gonna look for some turkeys. Because we need to get some of that plump bird meat. And, uh, yeah. I wonder if the bandolier actually does a perk, like if it actually does give you extra ammo or something, if it gives you an actual perk. I wonder. Alright, I'm gonna grab a drink, so, uh, yeah. Okay, that's one of those random encounters. I was in the middle of getting my drink and I heard gunshots. I'm thinking, what now? I just wanted to take a sip of my drink. <laughs> my soda. So, oh, it looks like we need to oil these guns up pretty badly. So, what's that? Just a stupid raven. Alright, hold on. Let's... Boil these guns up. These are pretty dirty. Man, they must have, like, grown cobwebs <laughs> from me being gone so long. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. I didn't even play this game a whole lot even when I was here the past few weeks. I played it a little bit, but I didn't play it as much. Just because I was doing GTA and I was working and stuff. But now that there's a new DLC, of course I'm going to want to play it. Try out all the new gadgets and gears and stuff. And our bolt action also needs some oil, but we're going to stick with our Evans for now. That is what we're going to do. Come on, can we find a turkey please? I wonder if they fixed the animal spawns and stuff. <laughs> I'm guessing probably not. Except other people on horses. <laughs> Yikes. So we're gonna start this cutscene. We're gonna get our moon shining up. And we're gonna make some dough, hopefully. Hello there. Actually, you know what I wanna do real quick? Hold on. I haven't looked through this yet. I wanna see what kind of stuff you can unlock as a moonshiner. Oh yeah, I forgot I have all these roll tokens. <laughs> So you get, what is it, a recipe? That's 
cool. So there's still the 20 ranks of that. Cool, I guess. Alright, ready my call. Let's get to work. You must be Crip's friend. I'll try not to hold that against you. Your name's Maggie. Thanks for coming. She's back. Jesus, what are you doing? It's me. <laughs> what the hell? I missed, didn't I? Don't uh, come in like a bull through the fence next time, you old fool. <laughs> Your friend here managed to get it right. Lightning Maggie Fike. We all thought you were dead. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> Guess you'll be wanting a drink. Oh, come yeah. on, give me a hand. Biggest mistake of my life, not marrying this woman when I had the chance. Yeah, you always did have a colorful memory of things. <laughs> Anyway, too late now. As you can see, I have gone and hit my prime. Well, I heard what happened with Hickson. Oh. Evil son of a bitch. Where you, uh, where you been all this time? Recovering. Lying low. Couldn't barely get out of bed for six months. And your nephew? Lem. Still in jail, as far as I know. Uh, you seen Danny Lee yet? Oh, yeah, I've seen him. Cooking for the Braithwaites now. Guess me and him were done. Well, there's always Marcel. Heard he's not working for Leclerc anymore. Feller's a windbag, but he knows his way around the still. Yeah, maybe. Feels like it'd be much easier for everyone if I just stayed gone. Mm. But life ain't about being easy. I am taking back what's mm. mine. Mm. I need legs, though, and I need muscle. Oh, you'll get that one, this one, and more, I promise you. Two of us already got a nice little business going. As long as you know, it won't be pretty. I don't do pretty no more. So, uh, what's the buy-in? First things first, I need a cookhouse. What's wrong with this place? Been empty for a while now. No, I need a good basement. I reckon I could try and get one of my old spots back up and running. Bastards seized them all after the raid. You buy me back one of those. I reckon you'll have a fair enough investment. Teach you everything I know. So what you say? Uh, believe me, nobody knows more about moonshine than Maggie. Oh, yeah. Listen and, to um... Her. You'll make that back in no time. 25 on, gold. You were made for Pretty expensive, other. but... I think I already know my decision. It's gonna be... Dun 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 dun! Which one? Which one? Nope. 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 That one. By you, cause... I'm proud southern boy. I love Lemoyne. And the Bayou is awesome. So... We are gonna go with the bayou. Grizzlies is way too far out. Hennigan's dead. I mean, freaking New Austin. <laughs> Heartlands. I, I, I would probably choose Heartlands as a secondary, maybe. If, if that would be my second option. That's a pretty good spot. Tall trees. Nah. So, definitely. Bayou is where it's at. I'm from the south. I love the south. And that's what we're doing. All right then. Partners it is. You meet me back there when you can. We'll work out what else it is we need when we get set up. Uh, can I offer you a ride, Miss Fike? Suppose so. Maybe we can stop for a drink on the way. We just had a drink. <laughs> I know. <laughs> now I want another one. Some things don't change. That is awesome. So, we're rank one moonshiner. We got a bunch of stuff, I guess, for being a part of it, I think. Oh, we got a viewer. Hello, viewer. Welcome to the stream. We just bought in our uh, place, Moonshiner, so I'm just looking at the stuff I can unlock. Get pamphlets, gloves, a gun belt, some a horse breed, the bar expansion. Oh yeah, that's right, you can have a bar. Well, we'll check that out later, I think. We'll see. I don't know if that'll be worth having or not. I just kind of want to get the feel of the moonshining business and how it's going to be like. So. Wait. Oh, this isn't my horse. Oh my god. I'm such an idiot. But we'll steal anyway. Oh. Really, horse? Wow. Yeah. That's what happens. I'm a trucker. Dumb horse. 
You didn't see anything, cat. Oh, you know, I should have killed it. I should have killed it with my new revolver. Oh well, whatever. Alright, so we're going to Lamon. The bayou. Oh, okay, it's gonna be right there. Going to the bayou. Lamon Raider right Country. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just love the South. Like some people might think I'm a racist or something because I'm from the South. Um, I mean, I'm not from Louisiana. I'm from Tennessee. That's where I was born and raised. But you know, <laughs> I just love the South. In fact, that's and I think I mentioned that earlier. That's where I was earlier. That's where I was on my vacation. I was in Florida. So we drove through Tennessee, although not the part that I grew up in. Uh, I was born in Nashville. But, you know, it was still cool to get to go through Tennessee and went through Georgia and, and then Florida. So I just love the South. And Lemoyne, even though I've never been to Louisiana, Lemoyne really reminds me of just the part of the South I really love, you know? So, like, I'm not racist or trying to be mean, you know? I just love the South. If you think I'm a racist for liking the South or, like, liking the Civil War, the Confederates, or whatever, then, well, then you obviously don't know me. So, yeah. But, you know, it's, it's just, it's, you know, it's all a video game at the end of the day, you know? Well, I'm a rabbit now. I'm looking for turkeys. That's right. I still gotta keep my eye out for a turkey. Okay, that's our camp over there. I'm not trying to do camp right now. In fact, I <laughs> I haven't even done a whole lot with the trader role. The only reason why I'm ranked 20 with the trader role is because I was playing with my other friend who, like, when the, the game first came out, I was helping him with his trader role. So that's the only reason why I'm actually ranked 20. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't be at rank 20. So, yeah. So we're starting off. This is our new shack. We own a new place, our new property. It's pretty nice out in the little bayou. We got any gators? Fortunately, I didn't see any gators <laughs> when I was in uh, when I was in Florida or anything. Sorry, I'm just thinking and looking around. But, uh, you know, it's, it's just cool to get to go back to the south, you know? So here we are. Let's go inside our new property and check it out. Enter my shack. Alright. Yeah, it looks like it's just like GTA Online, which I really don't like. I wish we could just walk right in without a loading screen. But, like, GTA Online, if you want to go inside one of your places, you have to... And you can't use guns. Yeah, you have to load, which I'm not a fan of, but whatever. So there's Maggie. My nephew Lamb's still in jail, and Danny Lee and Braithwaite are still taking our customers. Braithwaite. You let me know when you're ready to make a move. We shouldn't sit on yeah. this too long. The Braithwaites. <laughs> you know, and... I don't know if I should get into this right now, but... <sighs> probably not. So, this is the basement area, I guess. Oh, I can't even go into Eagle Eye. So, I know they were talking about we could get our, um... We could get a, uh, a, a club or whatever downstairs. A speakeasy. So, we're gonna check this out. We're gonna start ourselves up a mission to get our business up and running and learn how it works. Rescue cook, get equipment. I don't know. We'll see what this okay, does. Okay then. We're gonna need supplies and equipment so we can set up the still and get started with production. We could buy all of this, of course, but why would we do that? Yeah. We borrow it exactly permanently from some of the other moonshiners around here and kill two birds with one stone. Time to show these folks that Maggie's back. Back for good. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna hit them hard and we're gonna get our own operation started. Exciting. 
I just don't want to attack the Lemoyne Raiders, though. Man, they're good people. <laughs> Ugh, I know. Well, that's what I'm saying, you know. And I was saying this before, and I didn't know if I should get into it. But I just feel like the South is... Um, so, yeah. Where is it located? Is it far? Not too bad. But yeah, I feel like the South is portrayed as, like, racist and inbred and, like, bad people. Because in the whole storyline, they always make the Southern, like, characters, they portray them as stereotypes and, you know, they just make them seem like they're not what Southerners really are. I mean, sure, I'm sure there's plenty of Southerners that are like that, but I just, I don't know, it annoys me when they always, like, make it seem like, oh, the South is just full of these kind of people and no one else, you know? I mean, I'm sure, of course, there's going to be people like that, but there's also people, you know, bad people yeah, north, out west, out east, anywhere, there's going to be bad apples. So, um, hold on, I'm going to take a drink. And actually, I just realized I'm going to use my new gun. A Navy revolver. Yeah. Let's see how good this baby does. Should we try to do the stealthy first? Oh, no. Oh, wow. That sounds pretty cool. Wow, I like the sound of that gun. That sounds sick. And look at the, um, what the heck? Aim. Wow, this gun is sick. Dude, when you shoot, like, I don't think I've noticed that before. I think that's a new effect. When you shoot, it has, like, a new gunpowder or new gun smoke effect. I love the sound of it, too. It sounds so cool. I think it sounds better than the, um, La Mat. I'm gonna loot all these people. That is sick. Hold on, let's... Yeah, that looks like a new effect. I don't know for sure, whatever. That lo that, that's really cool. I like the sound of it, though. It sounds awesome. So we're now taking it back to our shack, I'm guessing. I don't know where else we could be taking it. Anyone else want to come after me and my gold gun? Anyone else? <laughs> I'm sure I'm probably going to get attacked again somewhere. Man, this is a really cool gun. Oh, yep, we got more guys coming after. Oh man, that sounds so awesome. That just sounds so good. Better than the Lamat for sure. Oh, we got some deer. Oh, is that a turkey? We gotta take it. We gotta take it. Because I want to get that challenge. We just need one more plump turkey. Thankfully, this is a private lobby, so animals are spawning now. Right. Yeah, I like this gun already. It's pretty cool. I wonder how good it is competitive, like against other players. to try it out later or something. Oh, we got more people trying to kill us. Cool. Yeah. That's a 
Uh-oh. What's this? Is this a... What? What on earth? Oh my god. Is this a... So, we got guy. Okay, great. Cool. They want to die by my new awesome gun. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> this gun is awesome. I like it already. And how much was it? Like 250 bucks or something, I think? It's kind of expensive. Not to mention all the upgrades I did to it, but... If it does that good, it would be worth it. I like that. Just think, I'm probably gonna um, dual wield that with my Lamat, and those guns will be like a beast. Beast uh, setup for sure. The Lamat's a pretty good strong gun, and so is um, this one. So I think if I could dual wield them, they could do pretty good damage. <sighs> Let's get back. I thought this was where we dropped off, but I guess not. We just had to fight them. And there's our camp, so we're close by to our shack. Shiner. So we got some XP for our new roll. That's good, good. Let's take a look. Nice. So let's go do another job or whatever setup thing. Let us go inside. Oh. Sorry, I'm just stretching. Okay, finish speak to her about finishing it so we got to rescue someone so we had to do two setups all right well next on the list is a cook can't do much without that as danny lee sold his soul to the braithwaite so we've been courting a feller called marcel friend of crips used to work as a chef for jessica leclerc but he comes from a long line of french distillers seems to know what he's doing problem is Another alpha got wind of this and grabbed it. So, let's see some of that muscle Crips promised me. Hmm. <laughs> That's funny the way they. Well, never mind. <laughs> so they're talking about the Leclerc's. I guess they're talking about from the other story missions too. All right, so. Yeah. Shiner's camp. 
Okay, they're not that far. Oh wait, they're in Clemens Point. Ooh. Dumb horse. So we probably gotta go in there, kill them all, and then take the guy to our place, I'm guessing. Clemens Point. I like this place. Then again, like I said, I just love Lemoyne. <laughs> We have let's get our tomahawk back, loot him. Yeah, we can't get them all because they're all right there. Oh, the Lemoyne Raiders. Sorry, guys. I got a bottle. Nice. Yeah, this gun's cool. I like it for sure. Who sent you? It was Madame Faker, huh? Yeah, get your butt on the horse, dude. Right now. <sighs> Back to the shack. I knew someone would come for me. And I knew that if someone came, it would be Madame Faker. You know her well. She and I have... Uh, History, uh, you could say. Well, a friend of hers is a friend of mine. Did Madame Fike tell something about me before she asked you to save my life? <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. I am Marcel. I was until recently employed by a lady named Madame Leclerc. Oh, yeah. Perhaps mm -hmm. you know her. Until I was kidnapped, that is. So they I wanted guess me for oh. my skills as a brasseur, one who makes a lot de vie, a moonshine, yes? Wait a minute, I thought you looked familiar. You came to visit Madame Leclerc once with uh, Orly, yes? Wow. Oh, <laughs> you look different now. Your situation has improved, uh, no? <laughs> I wish I could say the same for myself. That's cool, so this- oh. Alright, we gotta get out of here. I recommend shooting! Now! There we go. Okay, we should be getting close, I think. Yep, there's camp. <laughs> Anytime we see camp, we know we're close by. Oh, we got guys behind us. Aha! One of Madame Fike's old hideaways, <laughs> I see. I have some uh, uh, fond memories here. <laughs> this guy is fun. His accent's pretty funny. Excellent. Now, where is Madame Fiker? We have much to discuss. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh, cool. cutscene. Well, I am happy to say. 
We are officially in business. <laughs> Alizy, I will show you the engine room. <laughs> Thank you for your intervention the other day. I was turning into a rather unpleasant experience. <laughs> so here we are. Nice and private. <laughs> for obvious reasons, huh? There she is. Uh, our still a beauty, huh? Since I've been told that you are new in the business, I was thinking you might need some friendly mentorship. Illicit distillation is a very unique pursuit. Ah, but what is most important are the ingredients for the mash. The more successful the business is, the better the price we can negotiate for those ingredients. Just as we will, the more unsuccessful our competitors are. But that side of things is more the area of expertise of Madame Fike. Anyway, some of our buyers are very exacting when it comes to tastes and flavors. So we will need to adjust our recipes to the demand of our time. Attention! A stronger alcohol sells for more, as you can imagine. But it also takes longer to produce. So that is something else we will need to uh, balance. Huh? Well, that's enough for now. Let's get to work. I have a feeling you are going to learn fast. Okay, then that's interesting. So we're all set up. Rank three, club awards. Let's take a look at our progress here on our moonshiner. Okay, so it's 600. Oh, let's see. So I'm at rank three on my club rewards. Should I buy the wow forty gold to buy the outlaw pass? Hoo hoo! I could buy it. I got more than enough. Get gun oil or gun oil. Okay, it's not bad. I guess. Then we got five gold bars. Stable stall. Oh, that could be nice, actually. What's this? Oh, that John's outfit? Oh, that's cool. That's actually pretty cool. Ooh, 15. Oh, nice. This, actually. I remember I got this because that was really useful to have the roll XP boost. I might actually get that for that. I'm just, I'm just looking at what the other... Unlockables are here. Collectibles parcel. Treasure maps. Oh, cool. So you get some collectibles too. Nice. That's free money. Fast travel for free. I like those. Theater background. Buckskin mask. Huh. Pants. Horse care parcel. Man, I remember when I got the first one of these outlaw passes. Man, I got so much stuff I didn't know what to do with it. Hunting, resupply, one order of supplies. For, ooh, that could be useful for some free money. Dances, ability card. Huh, that could be nice. That, I don't really care for that. Clear your bounty, that's nice. Collectibles parcel. Oh, more collectibles. Moonshine ingredients, that could be useful, especially for this new DLC. Uh, Lolly Cola, Lady Cola. One mash refill. Is that mush? Mash, yeah. Five gold bars, nice. Provisions parcel, nice. Elk photograph. Oh, that's co oh, cool, so you can have decorations on our, uh, on our stuff, in our place. Ingredients could be useful. Treasure maps. Okay, outfit. What's this? A buckle. Nah. I'm just looking at all this stuff. Ammo parcel. Oh yeah. Incendiary. Yeah, that stuff is gonna be useful. Resupply. Moonshine ingredients. Collect. Oh wow, even more collectibles. Select saddles. Huh. Okay. That's kinda cool. Oh, that's for cribs. Okay, I wouldn't need that. 
30% off select horses. Fast travel for free, I like them. Take aim in a posse pursuit. More horse care, weapons parcel, man. They they're giving you everything here. Cloth wrap. Huh. Oh, that's kinda cool. What is that called? The Rex Road? That looks like Dutch's ba uh bandana. I wouldn't use that probably. Harmonica. 50% off select vests. Huh. Oh, before rank 15. Gold. Five gold bars. Moonshine ingredients. A bear. Oh, that looks cool. Resupply. Catfish? Oh, cool. Looks super unrealistic in a Wild West setting, but who cares? <laughs> in this era. Change your character's honor level. Okay. Fishing parcel. Baits and lures. Ability card. Coat. That's kinda cool. 50% off. Coats, okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. Camp equipment. 25% roll XP boost. That's nice. Gold bars. More gun oil. Fast travel. Oh, that's kind of cool. Ingredients parcel. Man, they're giving you, they're loading you up with everything. I still got plenty of stuff from the last Outlaw Pass that I've hardly used. <laughs> wow. That's kind of cool, that. Select outfits. <laughs> Unrealistic. Ooh, more collectibles. Ability cards. Square. Oh, that's fair. Okay. Man. They're loading you up. <laughs> they figure if you're gonna spend 40 gold bars, <laughs> you might as well get your money's worth. What is that? Potent Miracle? Oh, yeah. Ammo. Man, all this ammo. Wow. I'm literally, if I buy this, I'm, they're going to be giving me more stuff than I know what to do with. More explosive stuff. Ooh, 200 bucks. Neckerchief. Select saddles. Mystery reward. Change of appearance, okay. Beach, oh, that's kind of cool. Beach background, no, I don't like that. Select outfits, that's okay, I guess. Five gold bars, ooh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Boots, parcel, man, they're just giving you, ooh, I like that, I like the fox. More ammo stuff, they're just giving you everything, they're low, ooh, whoa, what the heck? That looks so silly. Is that real? Like, is that authentic? <laughs> I have no idea. That's funny. Resupply. Da, 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 da. Oh, man. They load you up. Select weapons. Wow. So even off select weapons. Camp equipment. Coin flip. More moonshine. Oh my god. How many more is there? Oh, up to a hundred, okay. Okay, I already looked at that. Gold bars, provisions, ammo. Ooh, I like that hat. That's cool. That's a tricorn hat, it looks like. Yep. That is sick. I would probably wear that for sure. That's like a, a 18th century hat. Select coats. Ooh, a husky! Right there! Right there. Faux show. I want that. 
I mean, I don't have a husky in real life, but I love dogs. Instant. I, man, if if only they would give you a Australian Shepherd as a companion, now I would be really happy with that, because that's the kind of dog I have. What is that? Prairie moon? <laughs> Silly. Moonshiner background. That's kind of neat. And got five more. Rebellion poncho. Man, they should have made a confederate. Con Rebellion harmonica. That looks interesting. <laughs> Mystery reward. The Oh, that's Arthur. Oh, that's Arthur's um outfit. His summer outfit. A buckle. Ooh, that's kind of cool. And five more gold bars, and that's it. Wow. That right there is a lot of stuff, and you know what? We're gonna get it, cause why the f not? Why not? Why not? We bought it. You know, we bought the first one. And there's some stuff I think I could definitely use for sure. Oh, hold on a second. And plus, it's up at. Yeah, I can easily complete it in, in March 2020. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it. There's. I mean, there's some stuff I probably wouldn't use. Um. Oh, wait, hold on a second. So, we're rank 3, and we already are unlocking stuff. Eye patch, 15% Rolex boot. Okay, yeah, I'm loving that. Let me look real quick. I know I'm, you're probably thinking, I want to hurry up and watch this. So, we're at rank 3 right now. We got our XP boost. We got an eye patch, which I'm not interested in. We got a buck photograph. And I don't really care for that outfit that much. So, so far, we're at rank 3, and we got 100 things to get to. I think we can easily do that. And next, we're gonna... We're gonna put that buck photograph on our wall if we can. I'm gonna grab a drink. Don't worry, it's not moonshine. <laughs> Alright. Moonshine is not ready to speak to myself. To reduce the cost. Okay. There you are. Ooh, moonshine moonshine okay, store. So what are we talking about here? Huh. Wow. Toxic Moonshiner pad clipped. But oh yeah, here's the bar expansion, the band expansion. Wow. Huh, <laughs> that's expensive as heck. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna buy that. Decor. Basic decor Yes, it might be time for some additions. Photos. Where's my buck photo? Hurry what? up, I'm a busy woman. Are you, uh, uh, it said I have one. Oh, do I have to buy it? Oh. Hold on a second. It said I got a buck photo or something. A buck photograph. How do I get it? I want to decorate my place. Okay then. Yeah, here it is. But I can't claim it. I don't know. Maybe it'll let me have it later. All right. I think we're just gonna get started on continuing more on our roll here. We'll try that stuff later. Right. I got a lead on my nephew, Lem. He's been in county jail since the raid, but I got word he's about to be moved to high security in Sisica. Interesting timing, wouldn't you say? Just as I get off my deathbed. Still, 
probably our only chance to get him out. The reason I heard is the law is moving another feller down to Sissica tomorrow. Weasley money launderer by the name of Stan Reardon. And we'll be transferring him onto Lamb's convoy at some point on the route. I digress. I don't give a damn about Reardon. But if you can track down those lawmen, find out where the transfer's taking place, hopefully you can get the jump on him. Just stay sharp. You did good with Marcel. Get me Lem too. You'll be well on your way to proving yourself. We'll see what we can do. So we gotta bust this guy out from a convoy or something. I think that's the gist I get of it. I don't know. Okay, we're loading into a mission now. I wonder if we're gonna get money for doing this. I hope so. Looks like there's a bunch of guys over here. I'm just gonna hold on to the chance we got until we meet up with the cowboy. Wouldn't want our route falling into the wrong hands. Trying to oh, never mind. I was saying, oh yeah, I'm trying to be stealthy. What? What? I died by one shot? Oh my god, a freaking rolling block? Are you serious? <laughs> That's ridiculous. Christmas.
Okay, yeah. So we're back and we are about to kill that dude. Hold on a second, we gotta Oh no, we lost our hat. There you go. That was kind of dumb shooting. Oh wow, the bodies you spawned. So were you? Are you gonna break this lock? Their bodies you spawn? That is stupid. You don't want us to loot, huh? Who are you? Are you getting me out of here? You want? Oh! Maggie! She is alive! Oh, thank God! Am I glad to see you! Get on my horse, dude. Oh, I thought we were just gonna get on the horse and go, but he's too scared. What are revenue agents? I have no idea. <laughs> They're dead. Are they like Pinkertons? That's what I was thinking, but... Who knows? Whoever they are, they're dead. They're not regular lawmen. There to be this many. Sound of it in the building. It sounds pretty good.
Is this meant to be like an endless supply of them? Better be the last wave of them. I did not expect to have like 20 of them. Oh, I got another rank up too. Cool. It's a fine looking animal you got there. All right then. Take me wherever my aunt is. All right, get the heck on my horse, dude. Wow, we got to ride all the way to Lemoyne. Oh my god. I didn't realize we were all <laughs> I forgot we were all the way out here. Sheesh. Well, Sure wasn't how I thought the day was gonna turn out. Aunt Maggie. <laughs> I don't believe it. I mean, part of me always held some hope. And there've been rumors. But that's why they decided to move me to Sisica. Figured if she was alive, it might be the one thing to draw her in. Guess they were right. <laughs> Problem is, they always did underestimate Aunt Maggie. Tough don't even begin to describe her. But you probably know this already. She controlled the moonshine business in Lemoyne for years. Until the government sent in that bastard Reed Hickson. Most ruthless feller I ever crossed paths with. He doesn't drink, doesn't smoke, doesn't curse, but he is pure evil. The other revenues we could handle, but once Hickson was after us, we just couldn't get off the back foot. Kept moving from place to place, but it was only a matter of time before he caught up with us at one of the cookhouses. Oh. Still makes me shiver just remembering it. Oh, they wow. trussed her up, blew we up got... the still, and threw her inside there to fry. I couldn't do nothing but watch as they held me back. The flames just kept getting higher. The whole place started caving in. I swear, it's the only time I've ever seen Hickson smile. Burning a woman alive. Hmm. Probably got a medal for her, too. The last thing I see is they're dragging me away. Danny Lee, hiding in the trees, just looking on. In jail, I heard they tried for months to hunt him down. But he must have found some protection. Hmm. Always did have a knack of slithering his way into holes, that snake. Huh. Wow. That's some interesting backstory we got from that cutscene. Pretty sad, though. She survived. That's awesome. <laughs> so I guess we're gonna be hunting them down, huh? Those are gonna be our main bad guys.
So is that the end of it? Good. Hey, Maggie. You're late. Hey, Maggie. <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh, I don't die so easy. I, I didn't know if you. Were... I know, but we're here now, and I am gonna make it right. All of it. Lemon <laughs> ami. Are you okay? Marcel. Oui, c'est moi. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, how charming. Lots oh. changed, Lem. Can I get you some soup or perhaps something stronger, huh? Marcel, put him in my room for now. But of course. Come on, then. I miss this old place. Get some sleep. We got a lot of catching up to do. <clears throat> Thank you for this. He's a dope sometimes, but he has <laughs> all I got. Go down and grab yourself a drink. Make sure you get an extra cut out of my side of the business. You've earned it. What are you waiting for? The rest you can remove yourself. <sighs> so I guess that's how she got those burns on her face. Yikes. I wonder how she got out. Coming to rescue me. Oh, I got money. We nice. shall make some good bottles with Maggie, yes? <laughs> Additional buyers, sun and shine. Oh, cool. Let's drink. Huh, okay, so that was one of our moonshine missions, I guess. And we can cheers and we can discard it. Alright, so we did get some money from that. We got. What was this? Benefits? Club award. Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's take a look here. So we're rank 4 in our past. Man, I'm going to be checking this stuff all the time just to see what I got going on. Oh, wait, no. Rolls. So we're, alright, we're about halfway. Just about with our moonshiner. Madame oh. Fike uh, would not like us to be so idle. Not bad, not bad. So... How do we continue the business? Making some money. Moonshine business. Yeah, we begin. Huh. How do I get... I have to buy it? Wait, hold on, what was that? What did that say? So, what shall we create? Seems a bit confusing. How do I get the ingredients? Do I have to buy it or can I just get it some other way? I don't know. Let's see what we got going on here. Get back our mission. Okay, so we've already done one Moonshiner mission. Yeah, it's probably from these. So let's go do the bootlegger mission. Well, I think you've probably gathered by now that there ain't much love lost between moonshiners. Just look at me and Danny Lee. And if folks want to play dirty round here, that's a game I intend to win. So maybe it's time you dropped in on our rivals and caused a few accidents. All's fair in moonshine and war, I say. And we're bringing both. Hmm. 